Lower run CD5 here with some quick draw. Woo, fun times. And yes, I'm still sick. So pardon my voice and whatnot. And looks like just in time. Hopefully it, this counts as a resetting and then I can get chests. Gold chests, that'd be cool. <coughs> that'd be cool. Yeah, quick draw. Awesome. Super fun and all that. Hello. Good luck. Have fun. Antimatter penguin. That's that's fun. Alright. Oh, ooh, wizards. Ooh, on this map? Ooh boy. Um Looking good already. His party is much better than mine, especially on this map. Wizards are not amazing on this map. Now, oh, dwarf, you're gonna be awkward. I feel like I should take the gust of war. It's normally, it's always gen generally just good, but god, these warriors can be scary. That's the whole point, right? Stay away, but damage. I might not have damage, but gust is just really powerful. So. Hello, spectator, not 369. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, this is scary. Oh, uh, combustible should be okay. Defensiveness, not okay. Defensiveness, definitely not okay. Sometimes okay on streams of blood, but usually just terrible. You do not want defensiveness. Oh, flash flood. Yeah, I can't see. Can I get? Can I see line of sight? Right? Oh, I can. Oh, sight lines are terrible. But if I get another move or something like it, flash flood can be very good for sure. So SBR helps me sort of control, sort of, but damage. <coughs> I do like SBR. Um, cause it, it picks off a card and then gets me out of range, of attack range of warriors. I'm really concerned. I'm really concerned I don't have, I won't have damage, so I want some damage, but. Uh, I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. It's early. I'm confused. I'm dumb. Oh god. Everything's weird. Oh wait. Oh. Instant Burn plus Lava Flame is pretty good. Telekinesis also very good. Telekinesis is very, very good. Combos with a flash flood. Crap, what do I want? I'll take the instant burn, because it's fun. If I get fire starter, oh, that'd be hilarious. Oh, I, I should have taken Mighty Spark. I should have taken Mighty Spark. I should have taken Mighty Spark. Oh, well, oh, oh, Spark Generator. That's like, eh, that'll work. No, it doesn't, because I don't have, because I don't have spark, uh, Mighty Spark. Ugh. <coughs> <coughs> Wow, that hurts. <coughs> Blind Rage is cool because it's a trait, but I could just take damage, especially turn one. Also, Tarnus sits in my hand, which is pretty good. But having the walk might be good for extra positioning slash runaway. Yeah, Glob of Flame sits around, but then I get Gusts of War and Instant Run every turn. Walks. Ugh. That could have been really funny. That could have been hilarious. Um. Yeah, I don't think I'm drafting well.
Um, ooh, wow, these are all actually pretty darn good. Greater heal can be interesting, but warriors just do a shit ton of damage, so it does, probably doesn't matter. Violence, quick run, helps me get in for like, snipe kills, or something. Violence spin messes with positioning really hard. Wow. Wow, this is interesting. So none of these are great on their own. And I need to make a pick instead of one-handed typing. Um, wow. Uh, I'm not sure on that pick. Quick run is really nice because again, I can surprise hit. I can use it, and and importantly, cantrip. I can use it to you know gain priority at the start of the next turn. Oh, those are all good, not great, but good. And I don't, I really don't know. Like greater heal would be healing eight's a pretty big number, but then like, um. Oh, a loner could hurt so much. Vulnerable could also hurt so much. I'm gonna be vulnerable the whole time. I'm getting messages. I think. Maybe not. Okay, whatever. Maybe I'm hearing things. Um. Damage, damage, damage. I'm taking a lot with loner. It's like vulnerable. I don't know what I'm doing. I it is early. I'm still sick and tired. These are all my excuses. Oh my god. Well, frenzy helps with damage. I need damage. Inspiration isn't great. Inspiration's better than spin around. Unless I have blocks, but. There's no guarantee on that. I guess I'll get some good attacks on this priest and the elf wizard. Really should take a mighty spark. Um, good defense, but I need damage. I I need damage. I can't. I am not. I do not like my chances. I am not drafting. I just really should have taken the mighty spark. That's a huge regret of mine. Uh, <coughs> um, triple heels. None of those were great. <laughs> triple heels is fine though. Block track and stuff. Ooh, Elf Nunes gives me quick run. Um, but damage and drains are useful. Really throws off the math and stuff. Yeah, always always a quick run is not as isn't it's cool, but wounded block, yes please. And actually because you sort of go through your whole deck and then it's empty and then until you actually draw another card. Like I don't think a second maneuvers trigger will reshuffle your deck. I'm not sure actually. Goes okay. See if I had a mighty spark, I could actually be like blasting him and stuff, and now but now I can set up for potent spark. Yay? With the gusts? So my dwarf just can't see anything. Like I could be cute and like see this. But, ooh, I'll take the obvious maneuver. Like I could be cute, but then I'm really far away from over here. Right, and let's check the sight lines from that spot. Yeah, it's not good. Not good. I don't know if you could run this way and then like stabby stab. Sorcerer's blast. All right, elf definitely has damage. Elf needs to say the F away from like everything. God, could you imagine them like having a brutal charge? Like if he moves his elf like if I if he moves elf in the brutal charge then. Oh, another flash flood? 
I can work with Flash Flood. <coughs> I can definitely work with Flash Flood. Oh no, you picked the wrong card. Um, oh, telekinesis, yes please. Okay, feeling a bit better. Feel like I can do things. Holy crap. Whoa. Whoa. Traits? But flank move. But traits. And a boost potent spark. That seems good. If I drop a flash flood, I have like a three card deck for a little bit. I think. Ah, this is hard. This is really hard. I don't know what to do. Weak armor can just sit in my hand. Yeah, weak armor sits in my hand. That's cool. Okay. amount of non-good this is, is incredible. Um, because I don't know better, I might as well start the frenzy. <coughs> <coughs> ah. oh, he's probably going to go over here, so then his priest can go over- oh, he's- oh? Oh, okay. Over here, see what he does. God, if he has a charge, I'm just worried about charge. I don't know why. Cause it wrecked me. That makes sense. Bam. Ooh, my asthma. Where are you going with your? Okay. Now I feel safe to go over here, but I'm still not in good flashlight position, which is annoying. Um, where can I? Good sight lines there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. Let's go here for now. It might be problematic with this guy, but I can I'm an elf, I can run around. Um I don't necessarily need to flash flood anywhere. I also might want to flash flood here just to prevent him from getting in on my elf. I think that'd be interesting. So, I mean, what else do I pitch, right? I want Gus. I'm gonna get. I'm probably gonna get Glob with Instant Flame, or Instant Burn. I'm gonna do it. Be cute. This is probably really bad, but let's yeah, let's let's do it. Let's do. Oh god, he didn't move on to the difficult terrain. Why not? <coughs> I mean, okay, I I've uh, okay, sure, wizards, but. Fumble. Whoa. Ouch. Fumble. If I get flashed with, that'd be so funny. That'd be so funny. 
He's running. He's going. He's going to go here. Okay. Start with the glob of flame. Okay. Okay. When he moves, then we'll drop the flash flood. I want him to burn the move, especially with this warrior, that'd be amazing. Okay. Oh, what? Okay, that's a problem. Wow, that really hurt. Use the gusts. Okay, so that's good to know. Oh, I don't want to put him there because of the flash flood. He could have done better, he says. How scared am I? I'm also greedy. <coughs> I do a decent amount of damage on this guy. Oh god, he has stabbed. Okay, it's good to know he has impaling stab, but. Step attack plus stab would be really scary. I'm so bad at this game. Oh, Jesus. Welcome to- what? What? Why are you going that way? Alright, we'll get the damage in. Why did you go that way? Drop the flash flood. <coughs> oh, damage. I also got some damage. Hmm, that's pretty good. That's almost certainly another stab. He wants to stack all the damage. I want nothing to do with that. Oh, you have to go. <coughs> and oh, it didn't reset. Dang that! No! Well, that was awkward. That uh, was awkward. Um, okay, well, that, that was quick draw. Um, 
Well, that's round one. Let's see what happens in round two. Now it's reset. <coughs> that's nice. Okay. Yeah, let's see what happens next. All right, time for round two. Quick draw on Temple Tussle. So round one it was unfortunately it to go. My slow play doesn't help me either. Probably didn't help. Um, but I don't know what it would have been. It was weird. Hello, good luck, have fun, old man Jenkins. Now I've got the warrior and the priests. And he's got the wizards. <coughs> um, yeah, let's see what happens. Hmm. Ooh. 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 This could be awesome. Advanced training is something I wanted to play with, but this. Inspiring presence is cool as well. Battlefield training. I mean, priest cards are weird. Sign presence could be funny. Let's go with funny. It feels battlefield training could have been really funny. Oh, jeez. What do I pick? Was that the right pick? I don't know. Priest, why are you guys so oh cowardly? But that's non bow with inspiring presence. Loner, it is. Hmm. 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 So you can see plenty of things from over there. Sing blow? Inspiration? More card draw? Ooh, cleansing burst might be good. The terrain. Let's just get more card draw. Inspiration is six range. That's so nice. That's so nice. Mmm, I'm a little bit cold. <laughs> Energizing move? So it's in my hand. Bash just attack for inspiring presence. I'm gonna take it. It sits in my hand and I can use it to help position me for good inspiring presence or something. I don't know what I'm doing. Let's face it, I don't know what I'm doing. This really feels like a disaster. Oh my god, wait. With the battlefield train, I could have given like the energizing move to my dwarf? Oh, that could have been hilarious. Then he gets it. Oh my god. Whoa. That's crazy. Alright, strong bludgeon, that's good. <coughs> I will gladly take that. <coughs> Mind Worm? That's an attack. Mind Worm is an attack. Admittedly, drawing blocks a lot better. I'll take the drawing block. <laughs> so much for this being the build around card. Well, for these guys, it can be a build around card. If I, then if I use the strong then I can draw the Spiding Presence, maybe. Unsapping Spear, yeah. It's an attack. I already have an extra move from Energizing Move. I like where this is going. Okay. Okay. Well, this is funny. Duck could be hilarious. Impaling Stab is just really good. And Violent Spin is move. It's a move card. Duck could be hilarious. I'm taking Paling Stab because of Inspiring Presence. Drawing multiple of those would be insane. Yes, I am really boring. Not taking Duck. How often do you have to play with Duck? Oh my gosh, I feel so dumb now sometimes. 
Um, Backbinding's probably better. Yeah, I have Inspiring Presence too to heal. And I'm, I have Dwarf HP. Dwarf HP does good things. A fiery Stab? Yes, please. Yes, please. As Flaxative says, the more stabs you have in your deck, the better. Hey, hey. <laughs> so I've got double edged sword, blazing short sword. What's next? Yeah, I'll take dodge. Can randomly mess with their attacks. Um, but more importantly, it's a walk. Honestly. Oh my god, catch arrow to be hilarious or, sh or strong bludgeon. Or more stabs. Wait, should he stab? Wait, yeah. Inspiring presence. Shifty stab helps me move, helps me stab, helps me poke. I'm just the stabbiest warrior. But strong bludgeon is just so much damage. I'm watching so much damage. Catch arrow could be funny. Catch arrow could be funny. But inspiring presence. Uh, I I do want steps. Let's take the shift to stab. A little bit of extra movement is always nice. I mean, they're wizards. They're they're gonna be running away and stuff. Need some way to catch up. Oh, what's my priest gonna do? Wimpy is not what I want. I'll take the weak chop. It's an attack. So sweet. My warrior will basically be always be drawing something from off inspiring presence. That's cool. More inspiring presence. How does he win if I have all this inspiring presence? Well, invigorating touch. Oh, concentrating around. Oh. Uh, erases terrain, replaces terrain. Card draw, card healing. Awesome. I don't know. This is interesting. Priests are so cool. Why is everything hard? Don't have good movement. Bearing touch. He's two wizards. They have multiple terrain effects. Yeah. Oh god. I want, I want all of them. I want all of them. And again, I, I don't have good reasoning. I don't know what, I don't know what I'm even thinking. Uh, what am I doing? Wow, talk about terrible. Wait, defensiveness could be funny if I just have attacks. One wall could be really bad. Among my eyes would be really bad. I get defensiveness and hope, but that doesn't seem like a good plan. If I had the drain, oh god. The bottom. I was really trying to take defensiveness. That could have been fun. Oh, I wish I'd taken the drain. God dang it. God dang it. That makes me really sad. Makes me really sad. Oh, frenzy your nimble strike. Frenzy's good, but shit. Nimble strike. More movement helps me attack, right? Benefits from the inspiring presence. 
Mass Frenzy really only helps this guy, this helps everyone. Speaking of attacks... Oh, there's an ins invigorating touch, and then, oh, oh my god. Why? Why? I'll be greedy. This run. Oh, I'm so dumb. This could have been defensive. Oh, this priest could have been so good. This priest could have been so good. Instead, I am a scrub. I'm a scrub. Um, let's take the shimmering aura. Cause wizards. Oh, I'm so sad right now. This could have been so good. Defensiveness with no magic. Priest, why are you so weird? Ooh, bad luck. Bludgeon? Bad luck, block track? Eh, bludgeon. Oh, no. I'm so sad. It's a trip? Trip? Did they see that? Did that just happen? Trip? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <clears throat> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Trip, he had trip. He had trip. Okay. Now let's pass. And pitch sapping, backbiting, probably shimming aura. Or maybe sundering. Both good options to pass. So I might not be able to get in this round, and I still have more attacks, actually. And if I'm getting vulnerable, but I have Inspiring Presence. How bad could it be? I'm, pro I'm probably getting vulnerable. How bad could it be? Whatever. <coughs> oh, there's a vulnerable. Okay. Okay. Okay, we're not drawing a card off of this guy from Inspiring Presence. It's fine. We can do this. He's gonna run. He's gonna be vulnerable. I'm gonna move here. I'm probably gonna use the nimble strike as a fly to just get past the civil terrain. It's like a seven range. It's a frost jolt. I'm really, really sad. And oh, but he can now. He can see over here. Okay. Walk, dodge, and shifty stab gets me in there. Did I inspire? I'll inspire you. Why not? Run. He wants my dwarf. One, two, three, three four, five. Okay. Let's let's start the parade. Let's get in there. Okay. I can work with this. A little shifty stab. Now this stops force stuff. Hopefully it doesn't get closer. Yep, that's some damage. That's definitely some damage you got there on me. Okay. Got 
Got a lot of damage. Does some damage. Gonna walk over here. Gonna use the nimble strike. And being greedy. Ugh. Oh. I am gonna be taking quite a lot of damage. That's that vulnerable. Surging bolts. You're getting closer to me. Let's draw some cards. Okay, you don't have damage? Are you da oh shit, that was damage. Got it, bro. All right. So, things are looking pretty good. I just did take a ton of damage, but I've been spraying presence again. That's good. So it's probably sad. It's probably really sad. He, he, was, I mean, these are dwarves. He did a lot of damage. Are you going to get closer? You're going to stand there. Okay. That's pretty smart. Um, woo! Cards, cards, cards. I can go, okay, yep. Yeah, you're, yeah, yeah. Awesome, new epic. It's all right. Sweet. Um, yeah. So, yeah, little aggro, and then, wow, inspiring presence, good things, good things. Yeah, if only that were in Invigorating Touch. Anyways, that's round two, let's see what happens in round three. Okay, C5, back for round three. So far, we're, I just checked, we're at first. Woo! Pretty good spot. Helps that my uh, first guy um, You know what I mean He uh Just auto quit Got warriors and priests again? Oh this is what I like, this is what I'm used to Two elf warriors and elf priest? Okay You can play this Hello there Sai Hayes, I've seen you around You've popped in my games before but watch me or Crystallis, whatever. Hello to you, Sai Hayes. I wish you'd just say something. I wish you'd interact with me. It's, it'd be fun. It's fun chatting with people, even though I'm not, admittedly, not very talkative. As you probably know from watching this video. And or from... I don't know. And... Oh, Chop is good. Pathfinding could be funny, but... You're probably not always getting something. I'll take the weak strike. Combustible's probably safe, honestly. Um, but, I don't know, elf wizards, be wary. Be wary of combustible when there are wizards around. Because they can randomly punish you for a million. Holy crap, yes please. Sets over Ochop and gets rid of his tax. It's like still good even with elven trickery, right? Um, all those would have been fine. Um, bash, right, mess with positioning. For victory square control, strong stab, it's a stab. Admittedly, strong stab is a shitty stab, but poke poke, it's not bad. You know, if I'm getting in there for the damage, let's get the overswing. <coughs> yeah, I'm very glad I took the dancing cut now. And if that weak strike were combustible, this could have been hilarious. Oh my goodness, harness, yes please. That was combustible and harness. Oh, five card deck? That would have been good. Instead, we just get- Oh, oh, oh. You don't get to play with this every day. You do not get to play with that card every day. And given how small the deck size are in this game, can't take drop card now because of it. Well, all those were armors or blocks, huh? Um... Probably unnerving, because warriors, they could randomly have blocks, it's good to get rid of 
fiery s <sighs> stab or damage. I like this flexibility of stabs. Really, eleven damage is a big number, but. Hmm. That should be funny. Combos with stab. Chop might be good though. Right? It's good on this map because everyone will be probably will most people will probably be around those middle squares. Um ooh, dodge? Random blowouts? Or more damage. Kind of prevents armor three as well, right? Wow. Dodge still randomly good. It's still randomly good, but I want the inspiring arm to keep triggering. But then dodge just sits in your hand. Slash is an extra move if you need it. Probably just taking the dodge. Right, that elf is just. He's a sitting duck once he moves. Which is awkward. Oh my god! Inspiring presence, awesome on both of them. Defender's block, also amazing. Defender's block... is really good. I mean, I think we all know that. But you know what I mean. Mind leak? Vulnerable. Depending, mind leak could be okay. Vulnerable. Mind leak. I'm doing it. Getting mind leak. See what happens. Let's see what happens. So far, so good. Take the sundering strike. It's another text message from someone. Okay. Take more blocks. Oh, yes, intervening touch. Alright, mind leak. Awesome pick so far. Draft wall, get rewarded, as they say. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Flank move good for priority. Roots good for trapping people. Or keeping them away. Flank moves really nice. I like priority. But trapping people? Slash keeping them away, depending on where they are, can be huge. Right? It just shuts down um, like step attacks, too, completely. For the turn. And I almost lost yesterday due to entangling roots. When opponent's entangling roots. It's really good for him. I kind of want it, but I also kind of like flank move. Flank move is awesome. Right, with defender's block, you can flank move into, into the defender's block range and then like do an attack or something. Or just priority, etc. I like oh, flank move is just so good. Yeah, high priority helps with this guy. Cause, oh, hello? Don't holy frenzy, probably better than savage curse. Oh, he's got the O chop too. Oh boy. Yeah, this is not good. And this guy's a good player. I'm probably gonna lose. <laughs> Alright, so that dash is saying don't go around there. That's basically what it's saying. Or I will do things. Or I will do nasty, nasty things. Where does Elf gonna go?
Where's my elf gonna go? I could try and go in, engage, but that's- I'm out of defender's block rate, that seems really bad. I'm gonna dash here, I have defender's block, protect me, and if he has terrain, I can dance and cut. Flash flood. That's what he was looking for. Okay. I can work with that. I'll dash to here then. So the out of line side, if he wants to come in at me, he doesn't. Okay. Alright, time to pass. Well, we got some weak strikes to get rid of. That's good. I like having the drain around. Um, ooh! I had to discard something. Wait, he discarded... Defender's block? Oh no, that's the beginning, okay. What did he get rid of? Big zap, I see. Okay. Now things get interesting. Oh my god. I do not have awesome fun card. That's actually kind of funny around here because it traps him. I could lead with this guy. Whoa, suddenly frame rate seems to have gone down. Oh wait! Wait, Elven Trickery gets the O-Chop. And sadly the Arcane Curse, but gets rid of the O-Chop. And he's a weak parry. Awesome! That was pretty good. Got rid of my dash. <coughs> okay. Oh, if you use the Vicious Thrust, that blocks me off. Subtle parry. Don't want him to draw cards, so we'll go this way. Wow, what happened? My computer must be like really sad or something. The frame rate is like atrocious. Okay. Oh, I should probably move in... I'm gonna move here, this prevents him from getting... getting closer to my guy. Oh, he can just do that, okay. Let's see what he's got? He's got a dodge. Now I should move this guy in... very soon. Like, right now. Now you have defender's block. Surprise! Oh, he's gonna... Oh, no. Oh. Success. Oh, my God. Winning. 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 And I'm getting lucky with the, that fail. Those fails. Can we go for it? Just in case he dies. I don't think I have time for the friends. Yeah. Okay. You got me, bro. So I frenzy myself. I don't want to proc the inspiring armor. I don't get to draw cards that way. That'd be really bad. Dangerous move. Goes that way. Okay. All right. I think we're in an okay position here. We've got a lot of damage. Um. Wow, lucky on those subtle, the subtle fairy fail. I dealt a lot of damage there. That's pretty good. Ooh. 
We can pass. Let's see what he does. Yeah, we can just see what he does. Oh, I have an Irving Strike. That's pretty good. <laughs> He's sad. Yeah, I've got nothing! And you've got a dead warrior. So that's good. Now he's in like the awkwardest spot imaginable. I'll go for it. Oh! There it is. He's going for the kill, it looks like. If he can. Um, but now the fiery stab will kill. For sure, even if dodge triggers. Oh, if he has a step attack there. Oh, ouch. Um, but, oh, wait, nope. Get the sure kill with dodge. Probably GG. Probably GG. Yep, Sai Hayes thinks it's GG, and it is GG. Awesome. Oh, yes. Epic treasure. Awesome. I needed it. Woo! Happy holidays indeed. I should... Yeah, happy holidays to everyone. I should... I should, uh... It's my friend's birthday today. I should say happy birthday to him. And I think we're still at the top of the standings. Indeed. But let's go all the way. All four games. See you in for round four.